dangerous and pugnacious snake. This snake and his close relatives range over the coastal plain and up this Mississippi River Valley of the southeastern United States from eastern Texas to the very southeastern corner of Virginia. The Florida cottonmouth is found throughout the state of Florida and on most of its barrier islands. This snake is still extremely common in some areas and often found in the flatwoods around the Reptile Discovery Center. Because of their large size, copious amounts of venom, and disagreeable nature, cottonmouths can, in fact, be very dangerous. Although the snake is almost never fatal, a bite can and does require antivenom and can result in significant tissue destruction and other complications if not treated properly. Wow, he is being angry. Cottonmouths can grow up to six feet in length. How big that is! Wow. Although three and a half feet is about average for an adult. They make excellent captives, and many of the hundred or so housed at Metoxin were bred, born, and raised here at the lab. They often live over 20 years in captivity, and they are excellent venom producers. As the snake is captured and approaches the collecting glass, we sometimes move his head past the glass rapidly in an effort to give the snake some visual stimulus and induce a bite. Sometimes, as the snake bites, you can see the venom gland just behind the eye contract. This venom is used in the preparation of profab antivenom, which is used to treat bites from all of North America's pit vipers. Although true aggression in cotton mouths is rare, and most of the stories are exaggerated, this snake will sometimes stand his ground, and when approached, he will gape, open his mouth, and show the cotton white interior. Giving the snake his name, Cottonmouth, and warning an intruder not to get too close.